Hi guys, so today's a bit of a Christmas theme video. <laughs> so I'm going to be doing like ideas for Christmas presents. So let's get into it straight away and I do hope you enjoy it and I hope it helps you. Alright, so for the first one you are going to need some scissors, some ribbon and a body wash or a spray or anything like that you want to use so what we're going to be doing is wrapping the ribbon around here so with this i'm going to be using this nice red one i'm going to straighten it out like so oh. and then i'm going to cut along here to the desired length and then using this, I'm going to wrap it around here, like so. And I'm just going to make sure that the two sides are the same length, so it'll be easier to fold in that. So all you do is that and pull it so both sides are the same. And then fold over that, so just tie a knot, let me move it closer so you can see, so we're just tying a knot, like so, so at the front there's literally just a knot, and the two ribbons are roughly about the same length, that make it easier, and then tie a bow. like so and that is your first present right there there we go i'm thinking that's nice with a nice red on it so there's your first present guys and then you put that in um a bag or a box or wrap it up or anything like that so the next thing is actually doing the same thing but use a chocolate bar to wrap up a chocolate bar so the colour I'm going to use is this red one right here so again I'm just gonna measure out the length I need this one's going to be a bit longer because we're going to need a bit bigger for how I'm going to wrap it up so it's quite a long piece and then it doesn't matter if you have it too long and then we're just going to chop that and it also depends on what length your chocolate bar is in that as well so now this is basically just wrapping up like a box so first thing we're going to do is fold these corners over and then fold this over long ways so it goes underneath like that and then on the underneath of it we're going to pull this over each other like that and then Fold it sideways like that. Try and make it in the centre, and then the bow will be in the centre at the front. And then just turn that around so make sure the colourful side is on the top. Turn it back around and tie enough. Right there, and then again tie the bow. And that is another present, just like that. And then, if you really wanted, you can cut these bits to a bit shorter. And I want to just show you this. So, I like it to be the same length, so I'm just going to cut it. Firstly, to the same length, 
like that. And then I'm going to grab them and in the corner I'm just going to cut but only halfway. And then the other side, do the same and match up with the corners. And now you will end up with this shape. So that's really nice. And there's our second present. So, so far we have this chocolate bar and this, mm. which is really good. So, this next one is like one of my favourites. I would be so happy if someone gave me this. <laughs> So it's not really that expensive, all you're going to need is a box, any size box, whichever you want, just an empty box. You can have it Christmas themed or it could be just for a normal birthday present. And then in this box we're going to have more things. So I've bought two packets, just all we're going to do is grab the box and the more pieces. And pour the markers in. So there's the one box. So we are going to need two. And the second one. And now, now we have that the box nice and full of more pieces. Just put the lid on the top. And then do exactly the same thing with the bow as we just did with the chocolate bar. So get the ribbon, make sure you measure out a long enough piece and just cut it. And I'm just going to show you this again guys, just so you definitely know. So grab this and then I find it's easier to start going long ways but you can go the other way. And then fold it under. And make sure the two are the same length and then fold them together and then around like that so that's what it should look like and then tie it and then this one's going to be a little bit like so on the top, just like that. And then instead of, if you don't have enough ribbon, like I only just did, but if you didn't have enough, then you could use one of those bows that are like already, um, already done. So that would be nice. That's a nice Christmas gift for you to do. And then actually this doubles as decor as well because if you didn't have the chocolates in it you could just put it on the side and it'll be nice. See just a nice decoration brighten up the room a little bit. So there's that. And then okay guys so I just wanted to show you this. So before I used this as a Christmas present but I wanted to show you it as a um, decoration. So I'm just going to out some tape so first thing you want to do is cut out some tape about this size can't see that this size and you want four of those five of those one two three So I now have five of those and I'm going to start this like DIY. Okay. So we need this and we're just going to make sure that that fits and make sure it fits on that side as well and just measure how long we need. So we need to about there. So I'm just gonna cut along there. 
And then using one of the tapes from earlier, I'm going to just tape that down to there. Tape it on like that. And then go all the way around, make sure it's nice and tight and centered. And tape down the other side. Exactly the same as you just did on the first side. Oops, so there we go. That's the first step. The second step, we're going to tape long ways like this. So I'm going to measure how much we need. So just do exactly the same as we just did. We measured how long we're going to need and we need to about here. Always go like a little bit over what you need just so that you know you definitely have enough. And then grab another piece of tape and stick it on the inside. So there's that. And then again, go over and do it to the other side. And then use the tape again to stick it down. And there we go. So now what we're going to do is grab this and thread it through that bit we just did. Like that, and make sure both the lengths are the same. Like that, and then we're going to tie a knot. Like that, and then. We're going to tie the bow and then just keep pulling until it's at the right the right bit for you. So that's right for me. And then I'm just gonna cut them a little bit shorter. So that's it. And now we're going to grab this. It's Maltesers so you can put it on your side and then you can grab a Malteser and eat it. And then you can just put the box back on and it's easier to open and close rather than before when I went all the way around the box. Now you can just open and close it as many times as you want. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thanks for watching. And I hope this helps you and you use it one day. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys. So the last one I th is the cheapest one. And I think it's actually like the cutest one. It's really sweet for you to want to do this for someone. So all you're going to need is a money box. I've just got this one. Doesn't really matter what it looks like. Just get it. Get whatever you think the other person will like. And you're just going to need... Some paper, some scissors, and a pen. So all we're gonna do is I'm gonna grab a ball, Selena, and we're just gonna write things, leaving a few, leaving like a gap between each thing you write. So we can write things like um Sun or something like that. So there's my first thing. 
and then we can use highlighter make an highlight the little picture so that's just there i know it's um a reverse picture but i'll put an edit of what it looks like at the end and then we can put um what i'll show you for you are a beautiful as a flower and then we can draw a picture of a flower and we can colour that in as well because why not we're going to be having a purple flower Colour that in, let's make it look a bit cuter. So there it is. Alright, so here's the quote. So I wrote, I wrote, Your face brightens up the room. You are as beautiful as a flower. You are strong as a tree. Merry Christmas and love you to the moon and back. And I just wrote little cartoon pictures to do that so there we go all right guys so then after we've done that here's just the quotes that i've wrote and all we're going to do is grab the scissors and cut them up so i'm just cutting around the words and we want to try and keep the lines as straight as we can So, there's the one, here's our first one, there's the second. The third. <laughs> Four. And the fifth. So I've cut out these five now. Yeah, they're all cut out and all we're going to do is fold in half in quarter to all of them so i'm just going to do that on them all make sure that you can't see the words through it all right guys and now that you've done that So, four, five there. You can do a few more, um, but I'm only doing five for now. But maybe I'll do a bit more later. Or... So then we're just going to put them in here. And then on this piece of paper, I'm going to write a note. Choose. A piece of paper out of this puppy for the compliment. of the day love
this go. Kiss, kiss, kiss. <laughs> so I'm just going to write that. And then I'm going to cut it out. But this time we're going to leave a bit of paper on the end here so we're going to cut it just like that and make sure we have paper there so we're going to fold in the corner just like so and then we're going to do a small slit and then but not all the way to the corner and then we fold it this way and again do a small small slip but make sure not to get it to the edges so now I have these four slips and what we're going to do now is cut off the triangles basically like so so now we have a little bit of a gap here you can do a circle but i decided to do like a diamond shape and then we just try and flatten out any bits that might be like that and then for this one i'm going to be using this um like smaller ribbon just so it goes through the hole and then I'm going to just cut a small piece just like that and then what we're going to do with this is we're going to put it through this hole here that we just made and then I'm just going to tie it around here so again, let's make the length the same. Oops. And then what you're going to want to do is tie a knot. And then if you want to go a step further, tie a bow. To make it look really nice and cute. Make it look a bit different than just a knot. And then we have this note here and we have the bow there so that's that done so i clean up all my mess now <laughs> but there we go there's the and then if they pull the thing from underneath then they could do a lucky dip and pull one out and then my one says you're as beautiful as a flower so that'll cheer my day up a little bit Alright, so thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helped. If you have any ideas, there is a few more that I'll be doing. And I'll be doing like a dog edition as well. And maybe I might do a small animal edition. If you guys just comment down below if you want that. And I'll be doing a lot more Christmassy videos. This is November and I'm already doing it. So we've got the whole of December to go, yeah. So I do hope you enjoyed it, don't forget to like if you did, subscribe for more videos like this and some animal ones because I will be doing a few of those on my video um, later on and then turn on the post notifications if you want to know when I upload and then follow my Instagram crystalan902 that's always linked below and yeah that's it. Comment down below what was your favourite idea and if you'll copy it and Merry Christmas. Bye.